A Hearn City Council member is under investigation tonight after allegations of inappropriate sexual conduct with a minor. News 3's Whitney Miller has been following this story and joins us now live from Hearn where a council meeting is just getting underway. Whitney. Steve, like you said, right now these are only allegations. I did speak with the police department earlier this afternoon and they say that they're at the very early stages of an investigation. All police are willing to tell us right now is that it was the minor's parent or guardian who brought these claims against council member Roderick Jackson. Police say Mr. Jackson called them early on to refute the claims against him. Jackson was recently elected to his term, his first term on the city council. Before he was elected, he was one of the community members who raised questions about the city's handling of taxpayer money. These allegations have been the talk of Hearn over the past couple of days, and there's a lot of unsubstantiated claims that are being put out there. But again, these there. These are the only facts that the police can confirm at this time. We spoke to Mr. Jackson's attorney this afternoon about those allegations. He had this to say. The, the group that's been running Hearn for generations has lost power, and this is their way of retaliating. We'll deal with it. When this is all resolved, we will probably be filing a civil suit against some of the people responsible for spreading the rumors. You don't get to just go around accusing people of crimes for political reasons. If you did not commit the crime, then you can be sued for a libel or slander. Now tonight, the city council will also look into other into changes when it comes to key positions here in the city, including the city manager, Pee Wee Drake, who recently resigned from his role. That story tonight at 10. For now, live in Hearn, Whitney Miller, News 3. All right, Whitney, thank you very much. We'll see you tonight at 10 o'clock.